What is the deal, beautiful people? My name is Ramon, welcome back to the channel. And on this channel, we discuss any and everything photography as I bring you guys along with me on my journey. Today, we have a very interesting question. And as always on these AMA videos, you can leave your question in the comment section down below and I'll answer it in upcoming videos. Peep this question, I love this. When you're taking a picture of a person, an animal or an object, the subject is obvious. After that, it's just a matter of finding a good framing for the subject. But let's say you're traveling, you're in a city and want to take a picture of a street. Is there a subject? You're in the woods and you have a panoramic view of the forest. Is there a subject? Or do you make a shot like, or how do you make a shot like this interesting? This is a, I like how he gave the examples here. This is a very, very complicated question. And I think at the core of this question, you will find the unrest of a lot of photographers, uh, a lot of people who are just aimlessly running about doing whatever, a lot of tech photographers, you know, they're masters at understanding the settings of their cameras and, and the composition triangle and what the camera can and can't do, but they just don't take good images. And I, I think this question, dry, it, it kind of connects that dot. For me, uh, and I'm gonna take I'm gonna take your I'm gonna take your two examples here. If I'm if and I if this has been me because I, I traveled quite a bit. Uh, if I when you go somewhere and you're traveling, and you're in the street, how do you make this image something? And and I it's it's a very difficult question to answer. And I've seen a lot of people try to make something special in post, right? Ah, up the contrast, up the shadows, and 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 put the HDR look at it. Like that's not how you make an image connect. It's about you. It is about your feeling when you're there. If if you when you step into this place, this place you're traveling, this street, uh, the woods, wherever, while you're there, you need to be in tune as as to how you feel about this place. What about this place uh, makes you feel like, I? oh man, this is dope, I like being here. What is so special about what you're looking at right now? How do you feel in this moment? And until you really connect with yourself and understand that, your camera can never capture it. Your, cameras, your camera is a tool, is an extension of your perspective and your feeling. This is why a lot of, uh, some photographers shoot things moody some shoot things super bright. It's just about how they were feeling when they were there. And once you learn to dial in that feeling, that 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 emotional connection to being in the moment, it's going to be super easy for you to create that subject, right? Because it's not about picking out the red umbrella at the cafe, but it's about the entire scene. And if 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 you feel this in your gut, that these people at the at the cafe sitting under the red umbrella is just having a meaningful conversation. If that's the moment that you want to capture, then I guarantee you I'll see it too. No amount of post processing can bring that to light. No amount of spraying and praying when you go somewhere is gonna give you that. I mean, you might get lucky, right? Let's let's be honest. Some of what we do as photographers is also luck, especially in street. But I, I think. The, the core the core answer to this question is you need to be in tuned to how you feel in that moment and that will allow you to identify the subject and you know as I prepare to put some of my work in galleries I'm starting to I'm starting to I'm starting to realize I have to define my work. And I think it's a, a super dope process, right? So I've got a ton of street work that I, I'm gonna be putting up for exhibition, but I'm, I'm imagining myself 
you know, there's going to be someone standing in front of one of my prints and they're going to do the cliche, right? They're going to be like, huh, what is this about? And I just want to appear over their shoulder and I want to explain to them, let me tell you why this is dope, son. Here, here's, here's where I was as a person, what I was going through in my personal life or whatever. And, and here's why I connected to this moment. Here's why this is dope to me. Can you see it now? Can you see it? Like that's that's something that I'm starting to have this conversation with myself. And I think it's super dope. Uh, hopefully you guys do too. But I thought I took a pretty good stab at this question. I'm interested to hear what you guys think about this in the comment section down below. And as always, with all of my AMA videos, ask me anything, leave your question in the comment section down below. And... Uh, I'll ask for it in upcoming videos. Like the video if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to check out the Lifestyles Defined podcast where we talk about everything. Uh, lifestyles, entertainment, tech, photography. Link is there. My name is Ramon. I'm out of here. Peace.